Today, friends and family said goodbye to the late judge Taylor Phillips, the oldest active court judge in Georgia. 41 NBC's Rashad Hollis spoke with people close to the judge earlier today, and he joins us now with the story. Judge Phillips' funeral started at 2 o'clock this afternoon in downtown Macon. Phillips died of natural causes. He was 91 years old. Friends, family, and co-workers of 91-year-old Judge John Taylor Phillips gathered at Mulberry Street United Methodist Church to say their final goodbyes. Uh, I've been drinking coffee with the judge probably for the last 25 or 30 years here in Macon. I best got to know him when I worked with Macon's mayor, Ronnie Thompson. She was a tenant in my father's office building down on 1st Street, and uh, he was always full of cheer. I was just a brand new lawyer at the time, and uh, he was always very helpful. Before going inside the church, people who knew Phillips signed the guest book and left special messages of encouragement for his family. Judge, to me, is the epitome of a Southern gentleman. Integrity, the way he treats people, and above all, the judge, most folks would say his heart was in the right place. He was always fair, and he was always full of good cheer. Across the street from the church, there's a sign that says, Thank you, Judge. Friends say it was his hard work and kind heart that they will miss the most. I, I, judge Phillips will be missed. Uh, the the a rock has been dropped in the water, but he will come back. Dave County Commissioners voted in February to name the courthouse in Phillips's honor. No word yet on when the building will be dedicated.